I remember it very well. I, I had, it was a Sunday morning, and usually on Sunday morning, I, I lived in Philadelphia, and my uncle and I and a cousin would go for a walk in the Wissahickon Park, which is a big park in Philadelphia. And when we came home, we got the news. My mother told me that Pearl Harbor had been bombed, and I said, where's Pearl Harbor? Nobody knew where Pearl Harbor was, I least of all. We, we just never heard of it. And, but we pretty soon found out. Of course, we listened to President Roosevelt speak, and uh, I was 19 years old. It was pretty, I was pretty sure it hit me right away that if there's a war, I'm going to be in it. And, go ahead. and then ten, 10 months later, I enlisted. Now, at that point in time, prior, just prior to Pearl Harbor, obviously the, the war was going on in Europe, and then the, the Japanese were advancing in the, in the Pacific. Did you have a sense that eventually the United States would, would get, into, get involved? I, know, I never felt that until the Pearl Harbor attack. Then, then I was pretty sure we were going to get into it, and I was going to be in it. And my brother, and my cousin, and everybody of our age was, was going to be involved. And I was a student at Wharton School, which I didn't think was necessary for the war effort. And uh, of course, immediately, the university, Pennsylvania Wharton School, announced, I don't know, maybe took a week, uh, they announced they'd be open all summer for anybody to want to speed up their, their education so they would not have their education disrupted, interrupted by the war. But I, I enlisted in uh, October. The Air Force said that they would allow me to finish my education. Of course, they, they didn't. They pulled me out uh, four months later in February. The university was nice enough to give me my degree. I only was at school for like two and a half years but I got my, uh, my uh, degree from the University of Pennsylvania Wharton School. Now you had mentioned that initially you had tried to get into the Navy. Yes. Well, I, don't, I, I really shouldn't go into that. I was turned down for having high blood pressure and it was checked three times and I always had low blood pressure and the Navy just didn't want us. The, the three of us, two friends and myself, we, we, we went down, we were all turned down for various reasons. The Navy just did not want us. The Navy Air Force, we, the three of us wanted to get in. I think they called it the V-5 program, and they, they wouldn't take us. So after the third rejection, the three of us went over to the Air Force, and it t took them maybe five minutes, they took us. <laughs> 